Hey, what's going on, guys? Time for a new video, and as you can clearly see, that I have a terrapin, and um, he's wild caught. Um, I caught him when I was out fishing, and I was fucking amazed because I was fishing for common carp, and then um, all of a sudden, it was way too heavy to be a fish that were in the little pond that I was fishing in, and then it was this huge terrapin, and uh, he's almost as big as he can get, I think. And um, he's got a little tuck. He's got a little um, snail hitchhiking a ride. He's really cool. And um, what I was gonna ask if any of you could like leave down like how to care for him and stuff like that. That yeah, really cool. I've done loads of research, obviously, and I've been feeding him loads of earth, like not loads, but you know what he needs of earthworm and bloodworms. And I'm gonna get him some lance fish because I heard that they can eat lance fish as well. I don't know if I should put a filter in here because he came from a pond. So you guys should tell me if I should put a uh, heater, filter, I've got it all, so if I need it, tell me to put it in, and he likes to chill on this rock and just like put his head up above the water, that's why I lowered it down a bit, so he can, um, so he can actually get his head up above the water, and uh, yeah, he doesn't seem to be that camera shy, usually I go near him, he just hides, <laughs> so yeah, um, and if, if you guys even suggest that I should let him go, then that I shall do, because I think he's really cool, and I would like a terrapin as a pet, but maybe I should get a smaller one, because I'd like to actually go out and buy one as well, because he came from a pond, but I don't see him actually being like wildly there, I think someone had him as a pet before, and then released him, if you know what I mean, because, um, yeah, you don't usually find these in my country, in a normal pond, so yeah, look, he's, he's gone to sleep, he shut his eyes, and he's going to sleep, or oh, he just died. Oh no, his mouth just moved. Yeah, he literally just went to sleep. So I really like, and I don't know if you can like take him out of the tank and like handle him, but because my brother was asking, and I was like, oh fuck that! Look at the size of his claws. The bigger than my finger. No, okay, that's an exaggeration, but yeah, look at that. That's his whole nail, and down there on his feet, fucking huge nails. Yeah, my brother wants to be stabbed. Maybe you should just go outside. <laughs> Ha ha ha, you know, please, don't worry. Anyways, so yeah, this is the new Terrapin I just got, and um, he's really cool. And if you guys could leave anything down below, any tips or anything, that would be really helpful. And um, yeah, I think that's about it. Oh, and I added this stripe of black tape to the edge of the fish tank because I got bored. So, um, yep, that's definitely all it. And if you guys want to see an update on the ID sharks, which are just over there, then um, leave that in the comments below because Jesus Christ they're getting bigger by the day and um, so yeah hope you guys enjoyed this video of my terrapin and even even if that's how you pronounce it right I'm pretty sure it's terrapin or turpin but um, yeah and there's a couple of um, sea snails in here as well because um, yeah they sort of came with the fish I don't know how they I think I tried to get some algae in there like in the tank and um, they sort of just all climbed out of the algae and that so uh, yeah, leave you guys in the comments what you want to see next, any advice for me on the ter terrapin, I know I said it like three or four times, so I'm going to shout now and peace.